Hey, it's Mel from Rap Rankings. To hear the full episode this clip comes from and all of the other episodes, check the link in the description, stop by raprankings.com, or search Rap Rankings on your favorite podcast platform. And please consider liking, subscribing, and commenting to help us grow the channel and continue our journey as hip-hop's first and premier extreme podcast. Track three, Mr. Me Too, featuring Pharrell, produced by the Neptunes. Uh, eight minus. Uh, we here now, okay? Main event, Mel, I'm here. Hallelujah. <laughs> I don't care how we rack up the Ws as long as we rack up the Ws. Here we go. This is the R-E-U-P-G-A-N-G. <laughs> Okay. I'm repping for my boys tonight. All my boys in Virginia. <laughs> Eight plus. There Ding me, go. baby. Uh, again, not my favorite song on the album. It's tied with Mama I'm So Sorry for my second favorite, actually. So uh, it's still not the absolute peak of this album for me, but it is nonetheless a highlight. It's a favorite. And man, talk about coming back with a single that actually made some noise when it came out, but didn't really sacrifice. Like it didn't just bring them back to the pop world, you know, as right. we're gearing up to put out an album coming off these two mixtapes. This is a street record. And this is a fly ass street record, but it's a street record. Nonetheless, this to me, this is Neptune's that still fits the grit that you have to have producing for clips. This is good sparse and sort of off kilter. I said, it sounds the, like that to me. I was saying like, maybe this was the last song they did for the album. But to me, this is the album. Like the, the beat that this song has doesn't, you know, lie to you about the type of beats you're going to be getting across the rest of the album. That's true. This is like just one of the best examples of it to me. Oh, this for sure. Another for one sure. coming up. Um, it's just it's that sound. I said the beat sounds like an alert that the crack pot's overflowing, so you got to run into the kitchen and turn the eye down. And that, it's like uh huh, uh huh, uh-huh. <laughs> you know we back right? Uh-huh. Oh, that you know we back. I do. This is my track one. Okay, we back officially. Album starts here for me. And that you know. boom, 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 boom. That boom, boom, boom. You got a Harlem shake to this. Boom, 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 yeah. boom. This is avant garde Neptunes at its finest, okay? Um, this is one of the great rap singles of the 2000s, and it didn't have to cater to the sound of what was going on at the time. It didn't even cater to the sound of where we had previously left with the Neptunes with, you know, records like When's the Last Time, Grindin', Cot Dam, etc. You know, this is a new, you know, sonic landscape. And man, I got to say the only Neptunes beat that I would say you can really compare this one to is Drop It Like It's Hot in the simplicity of it, but what it's able to achieve with its simplicity. There is that, but you mentioned grinding. And what's interesting about this beat to me is this is like an outer space grinding. It has that same Mm. simplicity and hardness that grinding had, but it's like now we're, we're out in in space with it. You know, it's a little more. Electronic. It's interesting now that you bring that up and the fact that, yeah, these beats in general across this album are pretty sparse and they just kind of lean on maybe one or two really strange sounds mm-hmm. that like, because grinding was the big record ultimately from Lord Willen, if they kind of decided to become like grind grinding pilled basically. Right. And they, you know, went head first into let's make as stripped down a records as we can. Cause that's the stuff that resonated the most with people. I never really thought of it like that. I just figured they were going for something darker this time around. And that's why the beat sounded this way. Right. Right. Yeah. And I think a a, a nice treat with this record is we get rap Pharrell when he's like peak rap form, you know, indeed. 
We Niggas talked about haters. it last I'm season. Doing deals like the majors, ice cream sneakers. I signed, I signed my, first my first skater. <laughs> you can pay three and buy yourself some. This is peak. Give me all your BBC ice cream right now. Music, okay? Do like you yeah. said. Set the game up. Dug a little boat. Mediterranean up. D class Asher cuts. Tuck your chain up. Liberace fingers. Hit Lorraine up. Just last week, I was out and asking me and somebody that we're not going to mention right now, both (laughs) us laughing. Week before that, I was out in Italy. Italian hot throbs could not Not get rid of me. me. Out in Donatella crib, me and like 10 hoes. (laughs) (laughs) Listen, I love rapper Pharrell. I love In My Mind. I love In My Mind, the prequel. I love his stupid verses on We Got It For Cheap Volume (laughs) 2. I love his stupid verse on here. Okay. He's the fucking man. To me, at this time, you could not tell me that these were not the people I should be dressing like, trying to make music like. This is the fucking wave right here. Give me all your Baby C ice cream right now. Let me get all the real and fake bait hoodies you got. Let me get the full zip. Zip the shit all the way up. Do the fucking Star Trek sign and the fucking, <laughs> you know, the Billionaire Boys Club dance. Let's, let's eat some ice cream. Okay, let's wear ice cream board flips. This is it. This is like, this is the this is the dream for me. The way Pharrell was talking about Slick Rick on the intro to that Gangster Girls mixtape. This is how I was looking at clips and Pharrell and Famle and Roscoe and all of these people. They were fucking gods to me. Hey, hey, man, they were on. They were on, and you know it's it's peak peak powers. You could say. I mean. I know Drizzy felt the same, okay? He had that signed microphone. That's why he, was, he, that's why he had that mic. Don't let he him He was lie feeling to you, something. He All was right. feeling what I was feeling. We're the same age, okay? You can fool somebody, Drizzy, but you can't fool me, okay? So listen, <laughs> I brought the record in for a reason. Um, because we got some interpolation style on here, and then we got some freestyles also. Got it. Okay. So well, let's listen to clips, Mister Me Too, featuring Pharrell, produced by the Neptunes. What a record! <laughs> Here we go. Uh huh. Uh huh. You know we back, right? Uh huh. Uh huh. Clear the streets uh-huh. out. Uh huh. Uh huh. Come on with it. <laughs> Star Trek. Niggas is haters, I'm doing deals like the majors Ice cream sneakers, I signed my first skater So you could pay three and buy yourself some babesters Bulletproof on the t-shirts because they hate us Dude like Snoop say, step your game up Double duck a boat, nigga, Mediterranean up D-class, ask your cuts, tuck your chain up Liberace fingers, niggas hit Lorraine up Just last week I was out in Aspen Me and Puff hopping off the plane, both us laughing Week before no, that, I was that out in name. Italy I tell you how I could not get rid of me Up and down a telecrib, me and like ten hoes Call from the cell phone, give me that Enzo I know what you're thinking, yeah, me too Okay, everybody meet Mr. Me Too Been two years like I was paddy wagon cruising Streets with George and Dunce capping and kazooing I was just assuming you keep the coke moving But I got one question, what fuck y'all been doing? Pyrex stirs turned into Cavalli furs The full lane cap and I we gotta get this. All my niggas caked up, son ain't Dust. Had that money right, I'll end up in the trunk taped up We don't chase a duck, we only race for bucks Peel money rolls till our thumbs get the paper cuts Chill retardo, South Beach Galato Teal started up, go brr like a snarl Woman, if you love me, please let me know Tie rags round your neck and learn the sets we throw these are the days of our lives And I'm sorry to the fans But the crackers won't play a fair job I know, I know Yep, yeah, you too Okay, we get it Yep, yeah, you too That was, that was a that, Listen, when they said I'm sorry to the fans Okay, we needed to be The re-up army We needed to be on high alert Okay, we needed to make sure That these crackers weren't Were starting to play fair over there At that jive, okay We were going to pull a lasers I'm telling you, and, and we and we got razors, so we're not like them damn lasers. Oh man! But yeah, we heard that you know, uh, go burr like it's Nardo. Women, if you love me, please let me know. Right, so we got right. this Nardo burr hip hop remix or hip hop mix that that's ah. interpolated from. Uh, here we go, Nar- Nardo ranks. Uh, Ain't no ranks. It it's ranks. What is it? Nardo ranks burn up. All right. up hip hop mix. If he's Nardo Ranks, he's Nardo Ranks. Is he related to Shaba? 
Good, good question. Actually, I don't know. I just knew him as Nardo. Oh, okay. here we go. Na 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 Nardo. 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 Brr, this I want a name original. Brr, everybody come and follow me. Say, brr, this I want a name original. Brr, everybody come and follow me. Say, brr, woman, if you love me, please let me know. But if you no love me, let me go now. Brr, woman, if you love me, please let me know. But if you no love me, let me go now. Brr, no discussion name. I'm Mario. Brr, from it. <laughs> right, 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 got it. Uh. All right, um, and we got some freestyles here. So we got three freestyles over this beat. This was the big one that got freestyled over, but we have a Ride Around Shining freestyle coming up later as well. Okay. So here is, uh, to kick us off, Kano, Mr. Me Too freestyle. We're going back to the UK. Hey, so I have the Brad Thomas in them. All yep. right, here we go. Yo, they hate ya when you're signed to a major I guess they love an underdog nigga with no paper But niggas need me in their CD player That's how I mastered the system like Sega Cause even if you hate me, your chick must love me Front row screaming cause she just touched me Back to the hotel, yeah that's for crease Tell the bartender to strawberry duck crease <laughs> Yo, they hate ya when you're signed to a major I guess they love an underdog nigga with no paper But niggas need me in their CD player That's how I mastered the system like Sega Cause even if you hate me, your chick must love me Front row screaming cause she just touched me Back to the hotel, yeah that's for crease Tell the bartender to strawberry duck crease Nighttime, showtime, relax all day Ask Ted and Tony about the yachts in Norway Back to the lab, yeah I'm fucking with Damon Track so messy now, I'm fucking with aprons May just gone, I was out in Jamaica Vibing with cartel, yeah that's major <laughs> You're on my level but I can't see you Cause we're on the same floor but it's not see view Now what the hell are you looking for can't a black boy make money anymore it's funny i can not even know none of you okay and All we right. got two more freestyles uh this next one is lloyd banks called uh clips ah uh, okay but spelled c-l-i-p-z because of course guns and violence yeah uh, but this is a you know collab between my two units at the time <laughs> right i'm only a unit soldier now that's right. Okay, here we go. Oh, um, I had it up to here for the year. You fucked up now, shed a tear for your peer. I pull a truck up round and tear up the square. Nigga, what's up now? I'm here, you scared. All of you niggas weird. Now, how many of them will my CD kill? I'm ghetto, I'm trill, I'm an easy meal. Years pass, niggas trying to be me still. Went from watching TV to a TV deal. See me deal, tired smoking your grill, chill. Rocks raised in a 3D field, yeah. Now I play behind a GT wheel still. I grind like I'm running out of time. Not he on me and coming by the dime. Slim, thick, fine, Gabbana design. Getting my whip wash while my motor recline. A quarter to walk in, another quarter to rhyme. Your time is so shorter than mine. Cause I hate mine whenever it's bread time. He's a perpetrator. I hurt the hater. Do some real dumb now. I hope it's worth it later. This ain't reverse behavior. This is free and A versus paper. I guarantee money not. This nigga got a real watch full of dummy rocks. Anybody that rock those is a dummy. And I'm gonna drop those in the Uh, he heard about my fake jewelry campaign. Okay. Well, fuck you too, Lloyd. Uh, he didn't hear well, about no fake jewelry. You just heard about most death. Okay. <laughs> the fake rings. Like, what in the world? Oh, my dad is, I guess, is he on his, did you hear that? Yeah. He's on his, uh, he must be on his Harley in the garage. I'm like, what is, am I about to get run over? Sorry, y'all. Was, that was, was a crazy. motorcycle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we got one more freestyle, admittedly, probably the worst of the three. But, you know, for historical purposes, I must include it. Okay. It's the curse of Achievio, right? Uh, yeah, Achievio up. Audio, yeah. So here it is, Asher Roth, Mr. Me Too Freestyle. Uh, he can't catch a break on this show, this Asher Roth. All right, here we go. The more 
Sitting in the rain, so comfortable. Nothing on my feet, got some weed that I'm puffing on. Ain't nothing wrong, I'm just hanging with this honey jar. And then I Cannon. get the nod. Bring it on, back. Can't, can't forget the daily kush.com. You know where to find us at, man. Great house of fun. I'm untouchable, sitting in the rain. So literally can Nothing on my feet, got some weed that I'm puffing on. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong, I'm just hanging with this honey jar. Hoping that I get the nod. Bring it on, slutty jar. Don't believe what be coming on. Nothing but the beat, skate P, let me run up on The BD drumming got me coming up with something raw Beat me up and cuff me to the gutters if I'm fronting, dog But if you're smart, put your money on the underdog Over, under, couple hundred, nothing ever done before Yeah, I'm a senator I feel bad for anybody who put their money on Asher Roth Great wow. guy, but Heavy shot at Scooter Braun <laughs> <laughs> So, Mr. Me Too Also, you know, on the last record Mama, I'm so sorry. There was that moment we were talking about where the beat drops out and you just get hi hat. Mm -hmm. You get that something similar here as well, where instead it's the um, <laughs> want to know the time better clock us. Redacted by the style from the shoes to the watches. We cloud hoppers, tailor suits like we mobsters, break down keys into dimes and sell them like gobs out. That section where the beat breaks down for a second and then it's like, you know, it's kind of just like dropped out and it's just the during that part. And then the hi hat comes in and then once who going to stop is not a goddamn one of you. <laughs> the beat comes in all the way. Shit is crazy. I gotta say, I'm gonna just say it because it's fucking hilarious to me. It's one of my favorite parts of the song. It may be problematic, but that chill retardo. <laughs> chill retardo. I mean, what do you want me to do? It's 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 good. All right. Retardo. It's the O. Oh, it's that's what makes it good. Rap speak, you know? Now, this song to me was actually like an influential record in the sense that we would go on to call each other. Mr. Me Too, like if we were at a restaurant and we ordered the same thing, <laughs> right, I'd say right. like, oh, fucking look at Mr. Me Too. No, it became a, a thing. I th my mom said that to me back when this song came out. I think, I think I had done something similar to her and she was like, oh, you Mr. Me Too now. <laughs> I forgot about that until just now. Listen. We made it a thing. So like, I, I don't want to hear it from people. It's like, oh, this never really became a thing. It's like it no, did it was to me thing. in it was my circle. So I remember no, it, was it was a thing. thing. It was. It was. You it know. was the circles. I, I heard other people saying it. And it was like, you know, sometimes it would just turn into like, you know, a roasting session that would be kicked off by one of us calling each other Mr. Me Too or saying, yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, man. You know, so I have a connection with this record, actually. It's like become a somewhat influential record in my life in a lot of ways. And, you know, as I was talking about in the background, when this single came out, it really felt like vindication. It was like, you know, the fans, we had gotten them to this point by holding them down in the interim, you know? Right. And we knew that there would be light at the end of the tunnel, that this label limbo would eventually give way to this album. What and are they just, saying these days? Like, it don't flinch for the Cody store. Y'all didn't flinch. We didn't flinch. <laughs> did not flinch. We, we suffered, but we didn't flinch. That's right. That's and right. that's what this record feels like to me. And it's so fly, man. Like, the slick talk on here is some of the slickest talk you'll hear from these guys. Yeah, yeah it's good shit. I love that. You don't want to know what the fuck I spent on it. Tomorrow ain't promised. So we, so live, we live for the, the moment. moment. Yeah, I fucking listen. Tomorrow ain't promised, so we live for the moment. Is is words to live by? They are. They are. Those are ag that's good ad actual advice. Okay. Um, I gotta point it out too. Now this is coming from Malice, who, as far as I know, didn't have as much of a problem with Wayne and the Cash Money camp. But want to know the time? Better clock as niggas bite the style from the shoes to the watches. I mean, you know, they was beefing over fashion. Yeah. And 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 I mean, here's the thing. Even as a Wayne Mark, they, they're not wrong because they were doing that first. So, I mean, but we, hey, talked, to, we talked about this on the freaking Got It For Cheap Volume 2 review right. on the mic check freestyle. 
Bape, you're late. We call you Tokyo buffoons. <laughs> right. <laughs> Tokyo Keep running the buffoons. Soho with them exclusives in my room. Redacted as biters. We let you slide with your writing. We knew that cocaine talk was not like you, but who goes as far as trying to dress like you? All right. Uh, well, hey. It don't hurt this record. This shit they know hard. I got the receipts, okay? Oh, yeah. This is Mules of Reup Gang, formerly of Reup Gang, forever a G Unit soldier. Well, I ain't got nothing else to say except for people who are still not supporting rap rankings are clearly Dunce Cabin and Kazooin, which is, which is an amazing, for the record, that is one of my favorite ways of phrasing people being like, you know, doofuses. You're Dunce yes. Cabin and Kazooin. <laughs> that's that's amazing that's just like that's elite rapping that's the thing that you're not gonna get from Pusha T in the good music era no you're gonna get a, a bad approximation of it a, a, a you know a caricaturized version of it you know but we can just move on we can we can I'll soak in my piece all right hey it's Mel from Rap Rankings to hear the full episode this clip comes from and all of the other episodes, check the link in the description, stop by raprankings.com, or search Rap Rankings on your favorite podcast platform. And please consider liking, subscribing, and commenting to help us grow the channel and continue our journey as hip-hop's first and premier extreme podcast.